Uh, today, I'm going to share with you the leading PKU symptoms as well as how someone gets this problem. Now, before I get started, down below, I, I'm giving away a free video-based guide all about dietary supplements as well as alternative medicine. Now, PKU is a disease that increases something known as phenylalanine in the body. And phenylalanine is an amino acid which is used to build things. I like to think of amino acids as like Lego pieces in a Lego world. They're used to create muscles, tissue, cells, hair, skin, nails, you name it. Now the problem is if too much of this amino acid is created, if it builds up in the body, it's not good. It negatively affects the brain and nervous system. And that's where a lot of these symptoms of PKU kind of are located at. And one of the most common signs is mental retardation. And people throw that word around, not, and not everyone knows what it really, really means. And what this really kind of means is someone lacks the mental ability to live a normal life. It's very similar to dementia, um, but it's diagnosed when someone is below the age of 18. If they're over the age of 18, then it, it kind of is more of dementia and not mental retardation. Now, apart from uh, mental problems, uh, there could be some issues with the nervous system. And uh, how the system kind of works is information is taken from things like muscles, skin, joints, and eyes, and kind of sent to the brain. And it's very quickly sent right back to the appropriate parts. And uh, this all happens very quickly. Think about like walking and how many stuff happens behind the scenes, unconsciously, unconsciously what we're doing when we walk or you know, when we wave to somebody real quickly even talking. Now there's a problem with the nervous system. Instead of say smoothly doing things, it could be more jerky. Say like you're smoothly opening a door, to op uh, reaching for a doorknob to open a door, somebody's hand can be jerking, like, light, like such as like light seizures. Uh, there can be issues with walking of course and any type of movements. And another sign of PKU is hyperactivity. This could, this could include things like uh, trouble paying attention, you know, it's hard to sit still for long periods of time, talking too much, or interrupting people frequently, frequently when they talk. Now sure, some people behave like this at times, especially if they're really excited, drink too much caffeine. Sometimes I'm like this. Uh, when I was on vacation, sometimes I was talking too much because I was so excited. But when someone's hyperactive, then of course it's going to be a lot more frequent. Another sign is eczema, and uh, this is when patches of a person's skin become inflamed, it's red, rough, and possibly itchy. Uh, there could also be like tiny bubbles on the skin that have like a liquid fluid come out of them. And lastly, someone can have certain, like a certain unusual odor coming from their breath, skin, or urine. And some people have described this uh, smell as like a, like a, like a musty smell. If you're not sure what the heck that means, you know, maybe just think of like a old wet basement or a dirty towel, musty, old, not good. And lastly, a person's skin, hair, eyes uh, could be lighter in color than other people in the same family. So that's another indicator. Now how someone gets PKU really comes down to inheriting a, a mutated gene. Now, for, so it's almost like being dealt a, a bad hand in life, sadly. Now the good news is that it's very, very rare and both the mother and father would have to pass on a defective gene for a child to, to get this ailment. So that's the good news. Now, if you are the type of person who is uh, interested in, in health and alternative medicine and everything, like I mentioned earlier, I, I do uh, highly endorse and recommend you check out a, a free video guide I created. It's all about this type of stuff. It goes over how to uh, shop for supplements, some tips on what to look for, how to save money, how to get some great products. It talks about alternative medicine, some nifty tricks as well to do some great things to your health. It's also uh, completely fun, so I'm, I'm sure you're gonna love it, you're gonna like it, and it's also free. To learn more, just click on the link below the video. Well, I, I really appreciate uh, you giving me your time here. Uh, please leave a comment with any more thoughts about PKU and. Uh, if you like the video, please give me a thumbs up. So uh, thank you so much and have a great rest of your day. Bye.